Hello guys, my name is Presim and welcome to a brand new camera comparison between the OnePlus 8 against the iPhone 11 and the Samsung Galaxy S20. Currently we are shooting at 1080p at 30 frames per second, which is the maximum capacity the OnePlus 8 can shoot. The iPhone 11 and the Samsung Galaxy S20 can shoot up to 4K at 60 frames per second. We have now switched to the rear cameras, currently shooting at 4K at 30 frames per second. Tell me in the comment section below which one has a better stabilization and which one has a better dynamic range. We are now shooting with the ultra wide camera and you can see how much wider the iPhone and the Samsung are compared to the OnePlus. But again, tell me in the comment section which one do you like better. Now let's start with some pictures. In this case all 3 did expose my face very well but you can see the sky is blown up on the iPhone 11. For me the OnePlus 8 here is the best picture. Again here I do prefer the OnePlus 8. The sky is more on the flat side, but it has a nice balance between my face and the background. The iPhone 11 is sharper and close second. The S20 here is my least favorite one. In this case I do prefer the picture from the iPhone 11 because it is sharper and my face is well exposed. On the OnePlus 8 and the Samsung Galaxy S20 my face is overexposed. In this scenario my face is well exposed on all three phones with just some small differences in implementations. I like all of them, but if I had to choose a winner I would pick the iPhone 11. Switching to the rear cameras, in this case I like the iPhone 11 a lot more. It is brighter compared to the S20 and has a better dynamic range compared to the OnePlus 8. The S20 in this case is too dark and the OnePlus 8 has a worse dynamic range compared to the other two. If we switch to the ultra wide cameras again we have very similar results. The OnePlus 8 again is brighter, but the dynamic range is better on the iPhone 11. The S20 is the darkest again. The Samsung Galaxy S20 has however a third camera which is a hybrid telephoto zoom. The third camera on the OnePlus 8 is a macro lens. The iPhone 11 has only two cameras. In this case again I prefer the iPhone 11 a lot more compared to the other two. It has natural colors and the trees on the background are very visible. The OnePlus 8 is darker now and the S20 looks like it applied a filter on it. I do prefer here the ultra wide camera from the S20 because it has punchier colors. The iPhone 11 is more on the natural side again and the OnePlus 8 is darker. We have here very similar results between the iPhone 11 and the Samsung Galaxy S20. Both phones manage to expose the grass and the sky. The OnePlus 8 is my least favorite one here. With the ultra wide camera again I do prefer the punchier colors of the S20. The iPhone 11 on the other hand again is more natural and has less distortion. The OnePlus 8 isn't as wide as the others and because of that it has no distortion at all. But again it is behind in terms of image quality. In this case again I can't pick a winner between the iPhone 11 and the Samsung Galaxy S20. If we look at the OnePlus 8 you can see it did crush the whites in the basketball hall. The ultra wide camera here is better on the iPhone 11 followed by the Samsung Galaxy S20. The S20 again wins in zoom because it has a dedicated telephoto camera. It is digital zoom on the OnePlus 8 and the iPhone 11. And between those two, the OnePlus 8 wins here. Again in this scene the iPhone 11 and the Samsung Galaxy S20 are very similar in terms of the colors. The OnePlus 8 again is darker but I do prefer how it handled the rocks and the river. With the ultra wide camera again I do prefer the colors of the OnePlus 8. The iPhone 11 is second, with the S20 being my least favorite. In this case all three are very similar to each other, with the OnePlus 8 being a little bit brighter than the other two. In contrast to the previous case, it is the darkest here, with the iPhone being the one with the more natural colors. The S20 again looks warmer like it has a filter on it. As mentioned earlier, the OnePlus 8 has a dedicated macro lens, but the quality isn't that good. It is not even near its bigger brother the OnePlus 8 Pro. Here I think the S20 is the best. Once again the macro lens on the OnePlus 8 did disappoint me. The iPhone 11 has more natural colors, but the S20 again is sharper and overall the best. Now let's move to some low light pictures. You can see right away that the iPhone 11 is darker and has a lot of noise. The OnePlus 8 is brighter, but it is a little bit blurry, with the S20 producing the best result. Just like before the iPhone 11 is the darkest. This time I do prefer the OnePlus 8 picture before the Galaxy S20. In this case I had almost no light and you can see the OnePlus 8 and the S20 are better and sharper compared to the iPhone 11. I like however the OnePlus 8 a little bit more. Switching to the rear cameras without night mode, the OnePlus 8 is the brightest with the iPhone 11 being the second and the Samsung Galaxy S20 the darkest. If we use the night mode, 
the iPhone 11 becomes much brighter and better compared to the other two. If we use the ultra wide camera without night mode, you can see they do struggle a lot. The S20 however is a little bit brighter. With night mode both the Samsung Galaxy S20 and the OnePlus 8 became brighter, but still far behind the quality of their main cameras. The iPhone 11 is worse because it doesn't have a night mode for the ultra wide camera. In this next case the night mode did a really good job on all three phones. I do prefer however the colors of the iPhone 11. The ultra wide camera on the iPhone is much worse because of the lack of night mode. My favorite one here is the OnePlus 8. Moving to this case I do prefer the iPhone 11 because it is sharper and has better colors. The OnePlus 8 is not that sharp and the Samsung Galaxy S20 doesn't have natural colors. We have the same results in this case too. The iPhone 11 is sharper and the colors are on point. The S20 and the OnePlus 8 are a little bit blurred. In this last shot I do prefer the S20 a little bit more. It isn't as bright as the OnePlus 8, but it is sharper. The iPhone 11 on the other hand has a lot of noise. So which one is your winner? Tell me in the comment section below. If you did enjoy this video a thumbs up would be appreciated. Thank you for watching.